Uh, Michigan school shooters' parents have now both been held criminally accountable for the rampage carried out by their son. Brett Cass with Scripps News Detroit has more on the verdict. Guilty of involuntary manslaughter. With the verdict in, the shooter's father found guilty. Four counts of involuntary manslaughter, one for each of the four students killed. We're strong parents. We are because we had, we had strong kids. We had great kids. That's Madison Baldwin's mother, just one of the parents still grieving from the shooting at Oxford High School. She, along with the parents of Hannah St. Juliana, Tate Meir, and Justin Schilling, lost their children that day. Now, more than two years later, they watched on as the guilty verdict was read. Just kind of a pause in reality. When you have that moment, that build up, and then you have that moment, it really is like a, a relief, um, almost like a breath of fresh air. Um, but it's not really a breath of fresh air because you still got to go through it another time. All four parents say their fight isn't over. They're turning their sights now to school officials, who they say should also be held accountable. Why can't we ask any questions? Let's let's have the opportunity to go to trial, just just like what it, what we just witnessed here. Let the people speak. We're being denied that right. It's a long road. It's a hard road, but we are all determined to go down that road. We we got this behind us. Um, it was a big step. Uh, we had our small bit of accountability on both sides, and now we we have to go for the big picture and and wrap this thing up and and uh, hold everybody accountable. Brett, Brett Cast, rather, with Scripps News Detroit reporting. Now, all four parents of the four classmates who were killed say they also want this verdict to send a message to other parents out there. They say the hope is that it might prevent future tragedies like the one they are still living through.